Hi, how are you doing Sagittarius? This is your reading for uh, the week of August 16th to August 25th. I really hope you're having a wonderful day. I really hope you're having a blessed day. Starting off your reading, you get the five, excuse me, the four of swords. Uh, you might be feeling a bit restless, losing some sleep about a situation. Uh, with the ten of swords, I get a sense of loss and abandonment. There might have been a situation around you or there is a situation or relationship that's causing you to feel like a sense of rejection, uh, a sense of defeat or just whatever you're trying it doesn't feel like it's coming out the way you want it to or just things are not going your way. Um, what does the terrorist need to know? Uh, it could be dealing with a separation with a, an individual. There's a sense of separation going on around you. Uh, somebody who you have a passion for, just somebody who you feel driven to. What does the terrorist need to know? What does the terrorist need to know? The devil in reverse. I think you're cutting off a toxic relationship that's been taking place. A situation you might have been in might have been a quite a tempting. It feels good, however, it's not good for you. And you're realizing that and you're getting out of that. With the ace of pentacles, I feel like you're following the financial opportunity, a big, um, a big score you might be seeing. Uh, something that increases your finances, your uh, physical life, or just your physical assets in general. You might be going after bigger balance, however, it's in its beginning stage with the ace of pentacles. With a magician, I get a strong energy over whatever you might be wanting to manifest your life. You have all the tools you need. Uh, is there anything that Sagittarius needs to know? Is there anything that Sagittarius needs to know? Uh, take a good look at your achievements, the work you have brought in your life, um, the effort you've been putting in. And uh, it will help you drop your guard. Um, maybe you've been going too logical about situations. With the Queen of Swords, I get a sense of, uh, I know you've been going through some changes, but it's about time you really release them. It's about time you release them and uh, proceed forward with the, uh, yeah. With the Six of Swords, I think it's about time you drop your guard and actually move on forward for the better. With the Six of Swords, it's an energy of maybe you've been stuck in a situation that was argumentative, conflicting, like I said, toxicity was around in this connection. However, with the Six of uh, Swords, I get an energy of you moving towards a situation that's a bit clear-minded. Uh, you feel a bit like uh, you can express yourself freely. Moving on from rocky waters to uh, calmer waters, uh, room to breathe. Uh, is there anything um, the terrorist needs to know? The tower. I think you're going through some changes with the tower. Um, and those changes really come with... Um, like a restructuring of the whole tower in general. Is there anything uh, Sagittarius needs to know? The coming off is quite established within your energy. Um, quite a magician, you know, they see you comfortable. Uh, but there is a big score with the Ace of Pentacles you might be needing to go after. A big opportunity. With the judgment, I feel like there's going to be a rebirth in a situation that was put on the side. I feel like pop, your purpose is falling, and uh, your purpose might be involving you to be in the public eye, to be the leader. Um, you're coming off as quite victorious, and you're leading people to uh, victory, or just you're making um, an effort to be... Uh, um, making an effort to uh, come off as quite a... Uh, a passionate leader. People might be seeing you as an example at this time. With the eight of um, with the eight of uh, cups, I feel like you haven't truly moved on from a situation that feels comfortable. Uh, maybe it's a habit that feels really good for you. Um, I feel like you haven't moved on from that. It could be people, could be energies around you. It feels like uh, maybe maybe you're not committed at this time. That's what I see. Maybe you're not committed. Yeah, maybe. Uh, you're going after things that feel good rather than things that are meant for you. 
and uh, I feel like sometimes that's okay and other times it can be damaging however I really see the hair front somebody might be looking for commitment but you're not truly to give in with the ace of wands I get a sense of inspiration motivations coming in for you new senses of directions is there anything the interest needs to know uh, three of cups a, a sense uh, there might be a third part in this situation and uh, you're deciding to really uh, let go and release it uh, it could be something uh, it started out as really good or just a separation between uh, our party members and uh, you're going to do your own thing to be on your own man uh, with the queen of wands i get a sense of standing your own ground uh, with the queen of wands i get a sense of independency and you are having wisdom at this time with a nine of cups, I feel like there's a wish you made. However, it's taking its time to get to you. Uh, with a nine of cups, I also get a sense of um, uh, what you are waiting on. It's going to take its time. However, it's going to get to you because I get the nine of uh, wands. Uh, a strong sense of uh, growth, expansion. With a nine of wands, it's a sense of uh, be patient. Um, be, <laughs> be patient. In terms of uh, what you might be wanting, it might not come right now. However, it's going to take its time and it's going to come to you. The wish you made is going to really be harvesting in the future. It's going to be coming to life. It's just like right now you're dealing with the uncomfortableness with your own surrounding. Things not really uh, working out to you. And that's the best time to really stand your ground and, you know, be who you are. Be yourself. So, yeah. Thank you, Sagittarius. Have a nice one.